why did I decide to come to Brock? Uh, it's a question I've been asked a lot in my past two years as a Badger. And frankly, there isn't just one simple answer. Firstly, the countless experiential learning opportunities and resources available at Brock allow me to explore the field of science. As an international student studying biochemistry, there were several important learning components to my degree, such as classes, lab experiments, and tutorials. These acted as an important catalyst for my educational experience. Even in an online platform, the lab assigned to us allowed for an in-depth understanding of the topic at hand, alongside a reliable and safe on-campus option to conduct these experiments. I knew living alone presented itself with a whole new set of challenges, but Brock provided outstanding support for international students, such as academic advising, mental health support, and also immigration consultation. Finally, Brock offers a number of opportunities to get involved. This helped me connect with the Brock and Niagara community at large. When making the decision to come to Brock, I knew there would be an abundance of diverse students and diverse opportunities. My involvement with clubs, the student union, and other volunteering activities truly fulfilled this promise and was an extremely rewarding experience. One of my most memorable experiences volunteering in the community was during the stem cell drive. Here I had the opportunity to raise awareness and also encourage individuals to register as potential stem cell donors. These opportunities, in addition to Brock's career-driven programming and support services, has aided me in developing professional skills that will assist me in my future endeavors. As I enter my third year, I can reflect on my time here as a Badger and proudly say that my time here has been extremely memorable. With the support of peers, staff, and faculty in the Brock community, this is an experience I will never forget. I know for certain it will only get better from here.